Welcome back, folks. On today's segment, we're going to show you exactly how to build a ballistic profile on your SIG Kilo 2400 ABS. Correct. And to start that out with, we're going to need the rifle, the scope, and a uh, pair of calipers or a uh, micrometer to get that started off with. Because what you're going to use that for is to measure your center, uh, your bore height, you know, from the center of your bore to the center of the scope. To start it off with, in order to get started, you're going to utilize both the, the range finder itself and you're also going to use their application, which you can find on Google Play or on the App Store. So when we want to go in here and first open it up, you're going to go ahead and click the plus sign, which is going to bring up the menu for setting up your rifle. You can name the rifle whatever you want to, 6.5 Creedmoor, which is what I'm going to build in here today. First thing I'm going to do is go to the library. <clears throat> I'm going to use the library versus, you know, setting it up myself because they already have already done it for you. So bullet utilize length, it, bullet everything, length, yeah. everything. That way the, you don't have to sit there and get into it too much. So 264 Burger, and then we're going to go down and find the one, which is the 140 VLD Hunting. And then once that's been there, it's going to bring up a selection. It's going to ask if you want a G1, G7, or a AB Custom Curve. Well, since you bought the SIG rangefinder, they give you access to the custom curves applied ballistics does. That's right. So, so always select the custom curve. Always select the custom curve. It's going to give you a more refined solution from the zero distance beyond a thousand and further. Right. So you're going to have a more uh, finite um, solution for your ballistics is the, what I'm trying to say. So I'm going to go ahead and select that. Now I'm going to go in and put in, take off and put in my muzzle velocity. So we're going to go by the lab, rate, the lab radar. Mine's moving at a uh, whopping 29.15 for the rifle that I have and utilize. Zero distance is going to be 100 yards. Then I'm going to set my sight height, which is 1.95. Then you have the selection there to bring in your zero offset, which we talked about in a previous segment. Yeah. So you have your zero height and then your zero offset. And then your twist rate, which is was the twist rate you're utilizing right. for the weighted projectile that you're using, which is a one and eight. You'll select off that. Now you've built your ballistic profile for your rifle and the projectile that you're going to be hunting with. All you have to do is hit save. And at this time, you're going to go ahead and select that profile that you just built. Right. You're going to turn on your range finder. And then you're going to go ahead and hit sync. And that's going to send all that data to your range finder itself. So now that we've done that, the next step is we're going to take, talk about this in another segment is we're going to go from here and out to the range. We're going to go ahead and find our target go by the dial-ups that it gives us, and we're going to see what the actual downrange results are. Right. So there we're going to have to true our ballistics. So the farther we can shoot, the better off we are. So we like to usually do this at least 1,000 yards. At at least 1,000 yards. And what we're looking for is to have this give us the exact data that we're actually seeing happen downrange. So if it tells right. me to dial up at 28 minutes, I'm hitting point of aim, point of impact is right there on the X. Yeah, and then we're going to make adjustments usually in the velocity, which we'll go over in another segment. Yes, and there's two ways of doing that, whether it's adjusting the velocity or hitting a calibrate function. I find that adjusting the velocity is a lot more accurate, but we'll get into that on a segment next time. So there you go. That's how you build a ballistic profile on your SIG 2400 Kilo ABS. That's your downrange segment for this week. Brought to you by Allen and Keith and McWhorter Custom Rifles.